Okay, so this is the review worksheet, Solving Systems of Equations. I'm just going to go over the word problems, just how to set them up. Okay, so um, if you look at 17, uh, you have a jar of quarters and nickels. So quarters and nickels are our two types that we're dealing with. And we know we have a total of 75 coins, so we're going to have a total of 75 coins. So quarters and nickels are what types of coins we have. So we're going to put quarters plus nickels equals 75 coins. We also have a total of $15.75. So this time we're talking about money. And we know nickels and quarters have a value. So we know quarters are 25 cents per quarter. So for every quarter I'm going to have 25 cents plus five cents per nickel for a total of fifteen dollars and seventy five cents okay so from here we could take our equation up here and we could solve for q q equals seventy five minus n with that we can now use substitution and take this and plug it in for q so point two five times 75 minus n plus 0 0.05 n equals 15.75. We can now solve for our n value, how many nickels we have, and then plug that back in and solve for quarters. Okay, um, on 18, and I'll let you finish that. On 18, it's very similar. This time, though, we have dimes and half dollars with 64 coins. So dimes, plus I'm going to do H for half dollars, equals 64 coins. Um, in the jar, I, this time I have $14.40. So again, dimes are 10 cents, plus half dollars, so 50 cents, is going to equal 14.40. And I would use um, substitution. Again, for my method, and either solve for D or an A or H and plug it in. Oops, I forgot my H. And get my answer. Okay. And again, I'll let you guys solve that. 19, we are looking at the bake sale. Okay, and at this bake sale, there are two types of cakes you're buying. You're buying cheesecakes. I'm going to say that is C. And chocolate cakes. I can't use C again, so I'm going to use K. So you buy one cheesecake and two chocolate cakes, and that's a total of $17.50 you spent. So one cheesecake plus two chocolate cakes equals $17.50. Okay, your friend on the other hand buys two cheesecakes and three chocolate for $30. So they buy two cheesecakes and three chocolate cakes for $30. Okay, so once we have our two equations, you could either do substitution and solve for uh, C right here, or um, I would suggest you use um, elimination. Okay, by elimination, I mean we could take this top one, we could choose to get rid of C and times this by negative 2. So that would be negative 2C minus 4K equals negative 25 and then we can add that and then eliminate our cheesecakes to get our chocolate cakes by itself. So again I'll let you finish that one but there's the setup. Um, on 20 we're going to use elimination again as our method and on this one I'm just going to set it up for you guys. So you are selling tickets. Okay what type of tickets? Student tickets. I'm going to put T for student tickets and A for adult tickets. Okay, students cost five, adult cost eight. I sell 350 total and I make 2,200. So I've got two totals. I've got 350 tickets total and I've got $2,200 total. So the tickets ones are just talking like types of tickets. And our types of tickets are student tickets plus adult tickets. Okay, and that was a total of 350 tickets. 
the second total is talking money. So I have how much each ticket costs. Students, $5. Adults, 8 So $5 per student ticket plus $8 per adult ticket is going to equal $220. So you could use elimination or substitution on this one. Both are pretty good options. Okay, I'll let you guys solve those. Um, I will post an answer key to this entire worksheet on Friday. Good luck.